another Kerika Chatty Sunday. So um, I am really excited because spring has finally sprung. Now that spring is finally here, I have so many plans for the warm weather, you have no idea. Um, one of which is actually going to be starting April 1st to start a new 90 Days of Momentum Challenge. If you guys haven't checked out my 90 Days of Momentum Challenge, uh, check out this annotation over here to see what happened in that 90 day journey. I don't want to get too much into that because I'm saving that for another Chatty Sunday because there's going to be a whole Chatty Sunday based on my 90 days of momentum part deux. Um, So fashion month is over, I think. Most people always see what it's like from the front of house when you're watching the shows, but not a lot of people know what goes into putting a fashion show together. I've had the opportunity of not doing it once, but twice. So when I was called by a friend, Nisha, to work with her to put produce the Josie Notori um, collection, it was a really awesome opportunity. The team was amazing. And we start all the way from the week before doing a model casting. The last day of my 90 Days of Momentum Challenge, that was actually what I was doing, working the model casting for the Josie Notori show. And the week after, we actually had the show. So it's a long process that goes into putting a show together. And I, being the person that I am, of course, wanted to document it all. So you guys are lucky you get to see what goes into putting a show together. Stay tuned and check it out. Mm. Hola chicas and chicos. So today I am working the Notori fashion show. Super, super excited. Gonna be doing some backstage coverage. Kinda, sort of, maybe, not really, not sure. But you guys are gonna um, see kind of what it takes to put stuff together the day of the show. Today is show time. Stay tuned. <laughs> Audio. Hello. Check out the beauty ninjas. Shadows team. This is Tyler Jane, by the way. <laughs> we are working the Notori show today with Nisha. Hi, how are you? So excited. Okay, I'm gonna I'm do a little transition. Okay. Nisha, tell us a little bit about this show situation. So it's 5:30. It's the Notori show. We have um, four, 20 models, 40 looks, and uh, Shishado is here. They actually flew in from Japan, and they're doing all the hair and makeup, and we're here. And the girls will start coming in, and we have rehearsal at nine, and the show's at ten. Be good, I hope. It's gonna be awesome. Be Nisha awesome. is the bomb.com when it comes to putting <laughs> shows and stuff together. Everyone's figuring out what the looks are for today. Oh, this is Aruna, everyone. Hello, this is Nisha's sister and helping us out today. Awesome. Our our vibe of positive energy. <laughs> Come after the storm, they're all dressed, so we're gonna do a little walk. beautiful I love love loved it I wanted everything the whole entire collection was inspired by Turkey can't you see the cultural aspect that's one thing I really love about fashion it reminded me of why I studied international business because I wanted to travel and have somebody else pay for it um, why I studied Spanish why I fell in love with it why I studied French and why I fell in love with it the idea of culture being something that um, is really reflective of not only the people that are there and the self-expression that they have, but just like the things that separate us but bring us together at the same time and how anybody can tap into that. Now that Fashion Month is over, I want to hear from you guys. 
which shows do you like the most? I mean, there's New York Fashion Week, there's London Fashion Week, Milan Fashion Week, Paris Fashion Week, and a whole bunch of others, as well as how fashion inspires you. Next week, we're going to be doing another artist spotlight where I'll be introducing you to my good friend, Errol Leonard, who is a New York-based photographer, and he's dope as McDope dopes. For now, that's it. I hope you guys have an amazing first week of spring. Live rich and happy dream chasing. And of course, as usual, please subscribe to Kedrika TV. Bye! Money, money, your money, money, money. You can take off your clothes. As long as you're coming home, girl, I don't mind. That's a lie. I should straight up done lie to the kids. Kind of just happened very organically and really, it was just a very, like, fun and fast paced and I was like going to science classes in the daytime and then going home and sketching so that it kind of started when I was studying to be a doctor.